You know, Duke, it seems like in the uh, in the fourth quarter, I mean, you were carrying the ball with all ten fingers. You you, you weren't taking any chances. Um, but, what, was it on your mind? You know, no, just to hold on to the ball. Not at all. Not uh, four minute drill. Uh, Coach Gordon stresses us to keep both hands on the ball. Uh, no matter where you run the stand, bounce, keep both hands on the ball, protect the ball. Four minutes, run the clock out, and go win. And that's all I was doing. How disappointed were you in, in yourself when you when you did fumble that other one? I was very disappointed. Um, because last week I had a fumble, but I extended the ball, uh, which made it easier for the defense to get it. But when I'm holding the ball and protecting myself, but I extend it and it comes out, that, that's a different story. Do you think anyone could be as hard on you as you, or as disappointed in you as you? Um, How much pressure do you put on yourself to? Um, nobody can be as disappointed as me, but they can try to match uh, my disappointments. Hey, but, you know, that, Hey, two cups. Uh, in the first half, we may have a time of possession difference, like 21 minutes to 9 minutes. Are you guys aware of that on the sidelines? Um, you, guys, you guys are on the sidelines a lot more than that. You know, their offense is out there chewing up the clock. Yeah, we, we expect that they'll come in and play Georgia Tech, um, the kind of offense they have. Um, we expect them to eat up as much clock as possible. That's why we had the ball, we had to make the best opportunity that we, that we can. Dude, Tony, you had a career high in carries. How's the body feel? Yeah. I'm feeling good. Hold up, all right. I'm, I'm perfectly fine. Um, yeah. Like I said before, coming into the season, the summer, is what, this is what I train for. Um, to be able to take some of the carries. Dude, what do you think this win says about Miami, this 2013 team, able to, to kind of slug it out in one of these games and win? Um, we're a tough team. Um, a team that, that's going to overcome adversity um, and going to stick together to tough times. The, you guys had uh, a couple of different looks up front on that offensive line, a couple of different guys switching around. How were those guys for you today? Uh, you know, how much does it, was your performance predicated on how good they blocked for you today? Fantastic. Um, I had a lot of runs where I wasn't really tested the second level. Um, and I'm going to say pride in, in not getting me touched, um, nor getting Steven or anybody else who touched the ball touched. Um, but they did a great job wherever they played. What does it say about the offensive line? You can put Linder at tackle. You can put Boot Bunch around, Feliciano around, Wheeler around. All those guys can play everywhere. Um, it says a lot. It says you know, no matter who goes down or what happens to someone, you have somebody that, that can do it. Everybody does it all. Uh, Dallas keeps taking your touchdowns. You, you guys, I mean, you guys have a little friendly competition going, or you're going to have to... Everybody eats. That's, that's something... That's something we do in the backfield. Um, if I'm tired, Dallas comes in. It doesn't matter where the ball is. It doesn't matter how close we are. If, if I get winded or um, if, if anything's happening to me, Dallas comes in and Dallas get the best of the opportunities. Obviously, I mean, your primary focus is get the win, but did you want to kind of keep 